to have you. All right, all right. Hi, everybody. Welcome to another episode of Oklahoma Swing and Country. We're glad that you joined us today, and you can tell we're going to have a lot of fun here with this wild bunch of musicians we've got. <laughs> we've had some inquiries about Leon McCullough, who's usually your host, and he's been sick. He's in a heart institute in Texas, but his doctors tell him that he's going to recover, and he'll be back with us in a couple of weeks. So that's good news. Excellent. Good to hear that. Excellent news. Okay, I want to introduce this wild bunch. Probably you already know who they are. If you don't, maybe it's been written there, but this is, and they're getting ready to go, Urban Almanac. Almanac. Yeah. I wanted to say Urban Renewal. Urban Renewal? Well, we need to be renewed. Urban Renewal, maybe even better yet. Thanks a lot. Thanks a lot, Daryl. That's great. Yes, exactly. Uh, we would like to, uh, from all of us, wish, uh, wish Leon a speedy recovery, as Daryl said. Good idea. Urban Renewal, indeed. Yeah. <laughs> Get him back on the set here again. Right. We're, this, that's why they call us the Urban Almanac, is because we, uh, we're from the city, so we tell you when not to plant things. Okay, that's what the right. Almanac does. Never plant tomatoes in the middle of the street. That's, that's, that's right. one of my tips. Uh, worked right. out real good so far. And one of mine was, you know, I bought, I was going to start a chicken ranch, and I bought like about uh, 3,000 chickens, and I planted you know, those little chicks and planted them all and didn't get a single one. Nothing happened. <laughs> None of them did. Uh, we're going to do a song that's uh, written by a friend of ours uh, from uh, uh, up in Alaska. I don't know. He lives over in Seward now, I guess. His name is Monty Davis. And uh, Monty wrote a song that I do with considerable pathos and style. It's called The Simple Song. And that's one of the reasons why we, uh, get, we just really agree, this song and I. <laughs> well, if I don't do anything else today, I'm going to take a walk up by the stream. Have him sing a song for me. I will find a shaded sunny spot, pull out my guitar, and I will sing a smile, I guarantee. Sing it, ooh, la 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 Lots of songs about those 18 wheeler trucks, CBs and disco dancing, spaceships and such. But there's always lots of songs of books, hugging and kissing. But there ain't nothing on the radio that's anything like this and singing. Ooh, ooh, ooh. La 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 Eyes of green, her eyes of brown She had the prettiest eyes around Oh yes she did, yes she did Oh yes she did I took her across old Parson Lake I thought that she, my wife, would make She said, oh no, oh no, not me I was born to be free. Oh yes, she did. Yes, she did. Oh yes, she did. Yes, she did. Oh yes, she did. Well, if I don't do anything else today, I'm gonna take a walk up by the stream. Have him sing his song to me. I will find a shaded sunny spot, pull out my guitar, and I will sing a smile. I guarantee, singing ooh. La 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 la
studio audience anyway. We're just here by ourselves. Well, uh, they're trying. They're clapping, but uh, you can't hear them. I know. Uh, the bus hadn't got here yet. That's what the problem is. I know. Hey, uh, Greg, you still have a rooster in there for us? Greg was playing with a sound effect a while ago. Yeah, I like it. I like it. <laughs> I like it when I hear the rooster. Come on, Greg, give me the rooster upstairs. Hey, there we go. Oh, okay, yeah. yeah. Good boy. That makes me uh, feel great like day in the morning. Yeah. Makes me feel like starting my chicken ranch all over again. <laughs> yeah, I know. Makes I want to get up and make some Folgers coffee. I don't know. <laughs> well, <laughs> Mrs. Mrs. Olson brings it by every day. You know, it's a Folgers. What, the rooster coffee? or the yeah. coffee? Uh, either one. <laughs> well, hey, here's something. Here's something for you guys to think about, and you folks at home too. Where we over here? Mm -hmm. uh, do you ever wonder what a ham had before it was cured? Okay. I was. Uh, what, what illness you mean? Yeah, right. I kind of wondered like you know. Hey, this is a cured. This is a cured ham right here. <laughs> I, got I don't know. I think you got that disease, though, don't you? Yeah, right. You're That's a cured ham. We're going to do a... Well, what are you talking about? Will you talk to me like that? Sure, I do. Hear this? Oh, we're going to do a Chinese song here called Tune In now, right? But... Yeah, this song is called Off to Colorado. Written by a good friend of ours by the name of Sam Ruth. Um, lived in Tulsa many, many years. Yeah. Yeah, that's right. Sam's, uh, I think Sam's in Louisville now. Still writing songs. Good composer. And, uh, uh, they had, him and his wife had a baby, didn't they? Named a baby Ruth. I think. <laughs> <laughs> Another one, but little Butterfinger. I'm uh, going to slap the hair out of your ears if you don't stop that. Yeah, yeah. The song's called Off to Colorado. It's a really pretty piece. Late summer travels on a highway with no wind. The only thing that keeps you going is knowing you'll soon be with your old friend. Your old friend being your only and only link between your past and your present. Your old friend being the only one known who knows how it was pleasant. And every day brings its way something new in an endless circle of trying to get to. Some less in the setting sun where there be some mountains too. But right now I'm in need of only you. And only you would be the reason that I come to Colorado. Only you is all I know there anyway. Only you is why I drove across this flat and dusty country. Only you would be the reason anyway. Off to Colorado, it felt so good to get away Across all that open country in an open-minded way I knew I'd soon be there with you, where you'd make me feel at home So just outside of Boulder, I stopped and called you on the phone All your short and sweet directions, send me soon to your front door Such a warm and friendly home you have with that old L-shaped front porch and the mountains in the background and it'll take my breath away no doubt about it you have made my day and you and me and everything we do are in an endless circle of trying to get to some pleasant the setting sun where there be some mountains too but right now i'm in need of only you and only you that I come to Colorado Only you is all I know there anyway Only you is why I drove across this flat and dusty country Only you would be the reason anyway That's called, uh, that's called mode at tuning right there. See, I had to drop oh, my in. This little music lesson. There will be a pop quiz next Friday, okay? So I'm like <laughs> what is this, basic tuning uh, 222 or <laughs> 222, what? 222, right. Yeah. Uh, that's, this is called the D mode. Actually, it's the most common mode, which is short for com mode, I guess. Is that what it is? <laughs> Why didn't you do that for the simple song if it's so easy, you know? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> I think it's pretty close right there. Sure. Mm -hmm. All right. Yep. We'd like to. Uh, Don't you think we ought to do an instrumental? That's about that time of the, the program where we should do an yeah. instrumental. Huh? You, th you think so? Sure. No, I don't. Good. I don't think we ought to do an instrumental. As a matter of fact, I think you need to be working a wheelbarrow and leave me alone. Well, really, <laughs> I think we should I do an instrumental. About a week. <laughs> we, we, we ought to do an instrumental, uh, an accordion song. What do you think? An accordion uh, song? Yeah. yeah. You got your sure? accordion? No, I forgot it today. Oh well. <laughs> forget the instrumental. I did bring the, f the fiddle. <laughs> the the Fidel. I started to say Fidel. Before we go, before we go any further, I think we probably ought to just tell everybody who we are. As my brother Mike Richards.
Richardson. This is Jim Allen right here with the Thank big you. nose. You yeah, can't you possibly can't, forget can't possibly Jim. miss that. Right. We've got to get a shot of Jim's nose. Here. <laughs> that's why they put, that <laughs> they is why they a, put Sailboat Bridge over there at Grove so Jim yeah, can lay on his back and go through there. But on they it. don't have that wide angle of lens, you know. <laughs> <laughs> that's right. Yeah. And behind us here, who else could it be but Ernie? What are we going to call you this week, Ernie? We Fishing in the dark, Ernie. Yeah. Right. Always give him uh, a new last name every Ernesto. Week. Ernesto. Ernesto McCoy. Close enough. That's Close. right. Ernie McCoy. Let me get my picks out, and we are going to do an instrumental. Well, you're in for a treat, too, because old yeah. Mike, well, I'll just surprise you with it whenever you see it, whenever he does yeah, this. Mike is a probably going to surprise me, too, when I do it. <laughs> More than likely, man. It's key of A, gentlemen. The song is called uh, The Milk Cow Blues. <laughs> Mr. Richardson. Yeah, that was yeah. good, buddy. That good was job, good. Mike. How, uh, it's interesting how you can, I always wondered how you could talk out of both sides of your mouth at the same time. Well, now you know. I had a lot of practice with that. That's right. You, yeah, you, you're playing the truck. You make a good lawyer. Let's get that. <laughs> so just call him old four lips, sir. You know, <laughs> four lips. I'd have my own firm right there, wouldn't I? Well, yeah, you would. Right. Mike and Mike, either yeah, side right there. Okay. <laughs> and associates. What's your, yeah, mouthpiece. Mike and Mike. Right. That's good. <laughs> Well, yeah, I've heard of two-faced people, but, you know, this is ridiculous, Mikey. Well, no, unfortunately, friends, you're, the trouble doesn't end here. You see, you got, <laughs> <laughs> it goes on because Mike's going to sing now, so I, nothing I can do to stop him. You know, I, I pointed a gun at him. You're still going to do it. Hey, anyway, hey, so. hey. <laughs> no, don't, don't tease him. Mike's got a beautiful voice. Yeah, I just yeah. heard all the heck getting it out. So. Yeah, that's true. <laughs> <laughs> Other than that, I do pretty good. I think yeah, probably huh? what you need to do is have your voice trained. 
Oh, yeah? Yeah, so? to, uh, to lay down and be quiet. Oh, yeah. <laughs> That's what key we're going to do this in, is a key of be quiet. Be quiet, yeah. I, I, like the, I like that Dinty Moore key the best. Which it's one's a, that? It's the key of beef flat there. Oh, beef, <laughs> beef flat. Okay, right. yeah. With chopped potatoes and carrots, a little bit of onion on the side and some seasoning salt. Okay. Good. Tune, yeah. tune that I got off uh, an HBO special I did with old Roy Clark and them guys there. I like yeah. this tune, so I just learned it. I was born in Macon, Georgia. They get my daddy over in the Macon jail. He said, son, if you keep your hands clean, you won't have them bloodhounds on your trail. But I fell in. Always bad companions I rob a bank I robbed it up in Tennessee And they caught me Way up in Nashville They locked me up and they threw away the key Oh Well, I washed up my hands Yeah! In muddy water I washed my hands, and baby, but they didn't come clean. Sing it, son. I tried to do just what my daddy told me. But I must have washed my hands in the muddy stream. Cause that jailer said, I win my time up. He said, Son, maybe, but we won't forget. And if you try, or just to keep your hands clean, we might just make a good man of you, yeah. But I couldn't wait. No, I couldn't. To get my time in <laughs> I robbed a bank I robbed it up in Tennessee And they caught me Way up in Nashville They locked me up in there Threw away the key Oh well, I washed up my hands In muddy water my hands, and baby, but they didn't come clean. I tried to do just what my daddy told me. Yes, I did. Yeah, but I must have washed my hands in a muddy stream. You know, I must have washed my hands in a muddy stream. <laughs> Good job, Mikey. Got them all. Thank you. Did you get them clean? Your yeah. hands. Uh, you got finally, finally did. <laughs> we like a we like a lava commercial. Well, I wash my hands. One soap get these hands clean, Mr. Lava. Is In a live volcano. <laughs> In a live volcano. <laughs> Frank, and there it is, Frankie Avalanche, yeah. folks. Yeah. 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 <laughs> all right. Uh, who wrote, who wrote like Chad and Jeremy up here? I don't know. Uh, who wrote that song anyway? You know? Uh, no, I don't know who wrote it. Uh, Charlie Rich what, did it. Muddy Stream. That. Muddy Waters probably wrote it, didn't he? Yeah, yeah probably. It probably was Muddy Waters. <laughs> Muddy Waters, MC. Yeah, yeah, you guys. Well, it's well uh, that's interesting. I don't know. You mean, and Charlie Rich did the song, but you don't know who wrote mm -hmm. it? I'm not sure about that. Of course, there isn't any uh, credits on the songs on a when they roll the credits on a videotape. So. You mean it's like public domain now? Did you see what they did to us? I don't last know about that. <laughs> Maybe it might belong to the SPCA, but I don't know about oh, public yeah. domain. See what the last show, last show that they did, what they did to us? You see that little thing, a disclaimer that says, uh, the station is not responsible for the Urban Almanac. There's probably a legal yeah. reason for that. Or anybody else in... <laughs> right, anybody, there was a good reason for that. Anybody else in their right mind, I like that right there. Of course not. Yeah, they might <laughs> do it again if we talk real Somewhere put, put the over the rainbow. <laughs> What's uh, that in your pool? 
Even, algae. What's that in your pool? Algae? Yeah. yeah. I'll tell you what I'm going to do. Uh, let's do a song by Tom Paxton. Tom Paxton is an Oklahoma boy. And he wrote, uh, he's written a lot of songs. He's a folk singer. Uh, this song is called Leaving London. And uh, obviously it's... It says live in London on our sheets over here, though. <laughs> what do you have to bring that up for? Well, you got to live there before you can I leave. I didn't bring it know? up, I will. It does say live in London. How are you going to leave if you, don't live, if you never lived there? Yeah, it know? does say live in London. I, when I typed it, I was, I, I'm sorry, I was letting my finger hang loose there. And it just <laughs> fell off the keyboard. What, head clapping again? Huh? You got a dollar sign up there where the S should have been, huh? <laughs> What? what are you talking about? Oh, that's, a, that's supposed to be a four, but there's a dollar sign, isn't it? Well, yeah, it is. Well, folks, what can I say? You know, our budget, <laughs> well, on this budget right here, it's just up to us. I mean, it's got a narrow mar margin of profit here. So exactly. It, yeah. we got a narrow, narrow profit margin. <laughs> this is a pretty song. With a dark and rolling sea Between my true love and me I keep walking this cold Hard town While I wait for better days Someone near I pray For a place that I Might lay my blanket down If I could make steel or borrow a ticket on some ship of a lane I'd be leaving London tomorrow To fly to my old love again Well, it's up at early dawn I've got to face the morn, then it's over to American Express. Not a letter yet today, oh Lord, how I pray, and I send her my forwarding address. If I could make steel a borrow A ticket on some ship or plane I'd be leaving London tomorrow To fly to my own love again Quite a while. That's live, true. Live in London, huh? 
Well, I wouldn't mind living there for a while, you know. Uh, you wouldn't mind living in Tulsa for a while. Yeah, a fact. I wouldn't mind living. Hey, you'd fit right in over there in London. You drive on the wrong side of the car, wrong side of the road, and everything. <laughs> you do good over there, I bet you. Yeah. Get, out on the, get on the road with old Jim. He sleeps on the wrong side of the bed. <laughs> <laughs> How would you know? He got up on there the other day. I heard yeah, about he did. That. Gets up on the wrong side of the bed. Him and Ernie both there. Yeah, I know. Well, actually, Ernie's the one that gets up on the wrong side of the bed. Right. I just challenge him. Yeah. Actually, Ernie's, <laughs> Ernie's back here. Didn't you have a cup of water or anything to throw on Jim tonight? <laughs> 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 right. Let me get my picks out. And we'll do. A, we'll do a song by uh, Chris Christopherson. Oh, yeah. This song is called. This song was recorded by. Jeez, uh, I even think uh, Elvis Presley did a version of it, didn't he? It's uh, called Me and Bobby McGee. Oh, like yeah. he did a version of everything, didn't he? <laughs> right. Uh, Janis Springfield. Did she, uh, who did Janis Joplin? Uh, yeah, right. Joplin. Yeah. Right. right. It was Joplin one of those did. Missouri towns. <laughs> <laughs> That's right, Janice yeah. St. Louis. Remember her? Janice, yeah. Janice, Janice, Janice Cartridge. Yeah, <laughs> Janice Cartridge. Yeah. Uh, Janice, uh, who else did this song? You know, I can't even think now. Oh, Gordon Lightfoot did it. And, uh, sure. Well, the Urban Almanac. Yeah. yeah. And the, of course, who's the most important man that we know that does it? The Urban Almanac. <laughs> and Chris, just see, when you get your royalty check, you can thank me for this, pal. That's <laughs> right. Rose color that he is. You know, he needs it. <laughs> <laughs> Ready, boys? One, two, three, and four. Bust a flat in Baton Rouge, heading for the train. Feeling nearly faded as my jeans. Baba thumbed the diesel down just before it rained. Rode us all the way to New Orleans. And I pulled my heart out of my dirty red bandana. But I was blowing sad while Baba sang the blues. With all the windshield wipers slapping time and Bobby clapping hands, I finally sung up every song I'm driving to you. Freedom just another word for nothing left to lose. Ain't nothing, ain't nothing, but it's free. Feeling good was easy, Lord, when Bobby sang the blues. Buddy, that was good enough for me. Good enough on me and Bobby McGee. From the coal mines of Kentucky to the California sun, hey Bobby shared the secrets of my soul. Standing right beside me, loading through everything I'd done. Every night she kept me from the cold. And somewhere near Salinas, Lord, I, I let her slip away. She's searching low that hole I heard to yawn. But I'd trade all my tomorrows for a single yesterday to be holding Bobby's body close to mine. Freedom does another word for nothing left to lose. Ain't nothing, ain't nothing, but it's free. Feeling good was easy, Lord, when Bobby sang the blues. Buddy, that was good enough for me. Good enough for me and Bobby McGee. This is the chorus here going on. Well, la na 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 la na 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 la na 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 me and Bobby McGee. La na 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 la na la la la. Bye bye everybody. La na 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 me and Bobby McGee.